guys, we're actually outside. That is fresh air. So it's a pretty wet day, uh, but that's not going to dampen the spirits, you see, because we've got a very special golf club at a very special golf course. Fresh air, so nice to be out here with this, well, a wedge that I shouldn't really be allowed to review because I'm extremely biased towards a guy that is behind this wedge. I love him, I really, really do. To the point where if Tiger did a TW Pet Rock, I would own it in seconds. It doesn't matter what it is. TW Toilet Roll, TW Rock, I will be purchasing it. Purchasing it. <laughs> but today's product is a little bit more useful than say a TW Pet Rock. It is the MG2 TW Wedge and it sucks. That nearly went in the hole. You record that way, not me. <laughs> I've got to take the wrapper off. I don't know if I should. Should I? Look away, shouldn't be allowed. Give me a minute. Ta -da! So let's not beat around the bush. Golf wedge reviews can be pretty boring, but I'm gonna try my best to make this one not boring. We're gonna have challenges in th spread throughout this video. Three challenges of different shots five attempts. If you remember Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1-2 on PlayStation, he had a game called Horse. He had five lives. You have to try and avoid spelling horse, so you've got five lives. Why well, have I said that twice? <laughs> so instead, it's a Tiger video. We've got to try and avoid spelling Tiger. So I have five lives <laughs> to try and, and not spell Tiger. Crikey me, that was terrible. <laughs> so we've got five attempts. Why well, have I said it again? <laughs> so we've got five lives, did you get, did you get that? Five. Um, Tiger is known for being very creative, short game wizard at times. I'm not, so great. First shot for the, to save the tee. Oh, it feels very yippy. It's been a while with a wedge. Got to go, I think. Oh, tried. Bit more elevation. Get in. Oh. It was like six foot away, but that's close for me. <laughs> right, this is the only chance we've got for this challenge to pass it. Got for the eleva elevated approach. Nah. It's your fault, that. Eh? All your fault. So if you own or even loved the P7TW irons, you've already purchased these wedges, you just don't know it yet. Available 56 or 60 degrees, custom fit only. And if you want that limited edition feel like you did with the P7TW irons, you can order a limited edition box too. Here is your box. The box is nicer than that, I can assure you. But the idea is, if you don't want to play them, you can have them as an outstanding display piece. Challenge number two, the pitch. Five shots at this. And it's great as well, because I'm on a downhill slope. There's a road behind, so I can knife one into someone's car. Brilliant. But the best part is, all I've got to do is hit the green here. I haven't, I've got to hold it. Some idiot made these challenges up. Right. And it's raining. I don't know, on distance here, I'm going in blind. Back left on that one. No danger. Hit the green though, passed in my eyes. It's a bit shorter. Good distance that. Just left of it. I'm scared to go for that for some reason. On the grooves. Sorry, Tiger. Oh, either side of it. It's a hard pin to get at, and the road's in my mind. 
be good. Ooh, dicey. Not a million miles away, last life. These are just set up for me to fail, aren't they? For me to look an idiot. Tends to be the case. I'd take all those though, to be honest with you. Especially that one. Right, look at them. Like, just tell me they're not that bad, because they aren't, all right? Not bad, honestly. Not bad at all. Not great, but not bad. Shut up. What are they? Yeah. I've just seen a black rabbit. It looks like one. It is, is that someone's pet rabbit? Oh, can you get it? Do you see that? Here we have a bunny rabbit. So when I heard about this, I was extremely excited because I love the MG2s. In my mind, the Milgram 2s are one of the best wedges that I've ever hit or played with. So I was very happy to see this. And this has got the same beautiful raw finish, raw face. The TPU insert to act as like a vibration dampener on the low strikes of the face. It has a specialized sole geometry. And also, with it being a mill ground, it's mill ground? It's not like a coffee. It also has a unique sole geometry. Geometry, struggle with that word as well. Then we've got the ZTP raw groove design, which basically makes the grooves deeper, thinner, longer, uh, just better at green sides, basically. In the 60 degrees, Tiger Grind features 11 degree bounce. And what Tiger likes to have is a bit of a relief on the leading edge. So when you open the face up, it stays flush to the ground, especially for bare places that Tiger ends up playing at. bit like that and of course it's had the precise milling it is a milled grind wedge and it feels fantastic get in oh a bit hard so I've got a couple of facts for you about this particular golf course this is the third oldest golf course in Western Australia dating back to just before I was born 1909 and the reason it's called Sea View is because, well, um, apparently the rumour is if you couldn't see the sea, it'd just be called view. Unsubscribe. Right, third and final challenge. We've been very successful up to yet, said nobody in the world ever. I've just told that person in the top left of that building to close the window, otherwise this ball's gonna be on their lap. Because I have got to hit a flop and try and hold it to this blue flag Five shots, last Tiger challenge. I've been, it's, I've been, do you know something? A few, the technique's been terrible, but I've enjoyed this wedge. It feels super duper. Love Tiger. The end. Hello. That's not a bad first attempt, is it? I'm so good at flops, really. If I was Greek, I'd be called Flopadopoulos. And I've chunked that one. Still all right. That's not bad. <sighs> that guy in that car wondered what was going off there. Green jacket, all right. Can you tell what I practice more? I struggle with a little chip, but flops, it's all right. Police are coming now. <laughs> right, last one. Look how close that is. Oh, and that's 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 <laughs> and that's the window shot. Spoke too soon, didn't I? <laughs> so that was a collaboration between one of the worst wedge players in the world and arguably one of the best wedges out there at the moment. The fact that Tiger's now got involvement in this makes it even better. Um, I'm sorry for the performance. The short game, like we know, is not my forte. Luckily, we're playing somewhere like Seaview. Makes even 
chunking wedges a pleasant experience thanks as always for watching guys make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell notification follow my social media the links are below just gonna stay here for a sec beautiful